electromagnet chamber. Interesting. Looks very safe. Oh, okay. I guess I need to bring the washing machine back? Hmm. That would be my guess. It's a solid plan. Yeah. And this takes us to... The green egg. zone. Takes us to egg. I'm gonna have to press a, a a button for each one of these floor or each one of the floors, aren't I? Search your heart. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know what? I'm good on eggs. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. So they have a you know a kind of a shortcut function for the level beyond the warp pads, but they have to make you of course jump through hoops to use it. It's like, uh, this level. I don't know. It has ideas. It it does. It certainly does. It, it, whether they're good ideas, um... Hmm. <laughs> Open to interpretation. But it definitely had ideas. It's ambitious. Yeah, I yeah. mean, I'm not gonna fault Rare for, uh, their... Unbridled ambition, we'll say. Yeah. Is that, uh, a, okay. that a thing? Yeah, that that looks like a thing, right? Yeah, I don't remember where the battery was, though. Ooh, I or, do. Like, the fun part. There's batteries all over the level. I remember where one was. Yeah, I remember one outside. I don't think we ever did anything with that. Mm -hmm. You could go get that back. You could, and you could bring it in here. Oh, I could, good night. Uh... In fact, you could take that battery from outside and take it anywhere you want. Top of the level, floor three, right here. World's your oyster. Yep. Aren't you happy about that, Argate? I, you know, on the one hand, it's really cool that it is as open-ended as it is. But boy, I think this game might be a little ahead of its time. Uh, I don't remember actually coming in here. Yeah, you tried to add this as the washer, but the foreman wouldn't let you. Oh, right. No, I remember this now. Oh? Oh, oh you got flattened. But hey, you have honey back. True. Another another puzzle that we can technically skip because we we got honey back <laughs> instead of the move it requires. It did. <laughs> We could just not bother getting that move at all. Amazing. Okay, where the fuck does this go? Hmm. Oh, that's... Oh, no, that, that's not what I thought it was. Nope, I don't remember a big fan. That, yep, that's a jiggy. Do you think that's Grunty's biggest fan? It's gotta be up there. Mm-hmm. Lady like her, I can't imagine she has uh, too many of those. Nope. I mean, where would you put it? Exactly. Yeah. He certainly is a big fan. Can you, um, do the thing nope. you did back in Jolly Rogers Lagoon to those? It... You know, the thing? Wait, what thing? To freeze it. No. Okay. I got nothing then. 
I can't tell if I'm making any more progress. I don't I, think I am. I don't think you Wait. are. So close, yet so far. There's an alternate way to deal with this fan. Yeah, I figured. I just w I was so curious, like, how far it was actually going to let me go. Points for effort. I'm thinking we'll come back. It's gotta be Grunty's biggest fan, though. Oh, oh! Almost! Oh. Okay, oh, sure. You see, danger flammable on the door, and their first instinct is to set it on fire. I just had to try. <laughs> what if you blew up the entire factory doing? Yeah, people will work here. You would you would turn into the latest entry from that um, accident review board that puts out YouTube videos about industrial accidents. I forget what what it's called, but um, I've, I've seen their stuff. It's uh, uh, chilling at times. What happens? That actually sounds like a pretty interesting series to watch. Mhm. Mm yeah, it's it's done by like the investigation board that. Um, investigates industrial uh, accidents and they, they do a deep dive into how the accident happened and uh, how, how, how it could have been prevented because they're, they're meant to be educational to prevent incidents like that from happening again. Shit, I kind of want to watch that now. I can get you a link for later. Uh, pl please and thank you. Mm -hmm. In the meantime, I guess I'll uh, pop outside to see if I can... Uh... Go find that battery from here. Yeah, that's where I remember one being. I whether there's more. I mean, I'm sure there are more, but um, I don't remember where they are. You can get it. There you go. Yeah, I'm here. It's a pretty big battery. I bet it's heavy. Well, if it's a, if it's powering big industrial machines, I would hope it's uh big and has a lot of capacity. Yeah. Like if if we're trying hefting a car battery, those things are heavy, mm -hmm. and that thing looks bigger than the car battery. Yeah, I mean it's it's about as big as Banjo's torso. Yeah, that, that's, that's something. Okay, now what the fuck did this do for us? Good question. You can access the waste disposal plant. It's, it's what you always wanted. Obviously. I love jumping into big waste tanks. Oh, hello. Hello. Uh, oh, hey, it's the move we don't need anymore. Yep. Huh. Yeah, so, yeah, so you, instead... Of, sorry, so if, but, if you were following the, uh, the normal progression pattern, this would be how you... It's effectively, it's honey back, but it's only available when you're just Banjo. Yeah. Basically that, yeah. I, I see. I was gonna say the same thing. Huh. 
This though, this looks interesting. That's an interesting thought. So that's uh, that's not your health, Argy. I, I know. I just had to know if this would uh, how well this is gonna work out for me. Um, not well, cause now you're stuck there. Yeah, this is true. Let all right, let's go. I saw something that said Jolly Rogers Lagoon on it. Uh. Hmm. Mm. Well, there were split up pads in that room. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to use that. Uh. You know, with the honey back cheat on, I don't think it's feasible anymore to, uh. Attempt to commit suicide to, uh, the death warp? I suppose it is. that is it one is. drawback. Yeah, it is. It's just harder. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, like, for instant, for falling, uh, great distances into, like, a bottomless pit, that's fine. But, like, just getting hit by these, uh, engineers over and over, I don't know if that's really gonna work out. No, they wouldn't, they wouldn't kill you fast enough. Fine, we made it. All right. I know there was a banjo pad. I just wanted to see what's over this way. Uh. Hmm. That looks like the Jolly Roger Lagoon side. Yeah, one of the pipes over here mentioned Jolly Roger's Lagoon. I saw it. Oh, oh no. Wow, no. no. okay. Rude. That's pretty rude. I hope I'm not stuck over here. I might be. Well, if, if you don't angle down after gliding, you should be fine. Did you keep angling down? I think you could do it. I'm no. angling up. No. Hmm. Okay. Uh, yeah, I guess, uh, rip our gate. Is there no way to, like, jank yourself up on top of that pipe? I am trying. <laughs> <laughs> Try, like, going for the bend. Wow. Oh, yeah. yeah. It, it, you should yeah, totally just be don't able glide. to jump onto, like, the corner of that bend. Yeah, just, just don't glide. Yeah. Hang on. Okay, okay, okay. Now you have enough height. There, there we, go. we go. Okay. Whew, thank goodness. That was almost a soft lock. Yeah, what a weird place for an almost soft lock. <sighs> I am relieved. Well, you're gonna have to ditch the bird anyway because uh, that switch was only banjo. Yeah, I just don't understand. Uh... You have another move that might allow you to cross that. Mm. Oh, right. Hey, now he remembers his moveset. I'm it's, gonna get a little closer. Yeah, it's silly, but you know. <laughs> this no. is Banjo Kazooie. Yeah, little known fact by putting your backpack over your head, you become literally invincible. No amount of toxic water can stop you. Yep. It's foolproof. I mean, I know that's what they always taught us in hazmat training. Okay, that, that's a fence. Or great, whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now how do you get 
out of here? That's not gonna work. Oh. Okay, why? Why would you do I that? I was curious. See how long it would last. Oh. Nope. And that's a uh, nap time banjo. Eventually he'll get it. Okay. Yep. No, I was just re reviewing. Okay. So okay. being able to to go through the the sludge is one thing. Uh, trying to resurface is it gonna be another? Uh, I got nothing. Great question. Indeed. I know. Oh, huh? oh, 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 okay, okay. That, that was, was interesting. Almost, that was almost something. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, am I even able to get this right now? Genuine answer, I don't know. I assume yes, because we uh, this is the last level and we've got all the moves, but... Oh, we are missing one. I don't know if that's... That, that'll mean anything. The move that we're missing is for Kazooie, so the, no, yeah. it does not. Okay. And that just takes us back up here. I just sum that up she gets with those. It's very impressive. Yeah, I remember what the last move is, and I don't think that one's gonna help us. Hang on, hang on, there's a ladder on the other side. Where does that connect to? I genuinely don't know. I guess we'll find out with Kazooie. It just comes out of a hole in the wall. Back back can't climb ladders, right? No. Okay. Where does the up ladder go? Yeah, try looking up. That's just That's a hole. So there's another entrance. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So the, through the toxic water with the backpack is how you get back. Uh, or, is it? It's how you get the jiggy at the bottom. Yeah. yeah this, is, this is something else. This is a separate jiggy. There are two in this room. Mm-hmm. I don't know, this level hurts my brain. Alright, we'll, we'll come back later, I suppose. Hailfire Peaks Hailfire oil Peaks? pipeline? There was oil in Hailfire Peaks? Hmm? I think I remember. That was like the the big digging thing, right? Yeah, on, oh. the, yeah, on the ice side. Okay, okay. Yeah, so if that's water, then yeah, Jolly Rogers Lagoon water pipeline. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, this is a big industrial operation. Oh, well, nothing else. Uh, glad we got that open. Um. Okay. Well, so I do remember. I do remember we opened up some flight pads, so let's go take a look at that. There was one near the. Yes, that's a good idea. I don't know if it was a Jinjo or a Minjo. We'll find out. If you have to work for it, it's a Jinjo. Yeah. Yeah. Generally. Like that, that's universally the answer. If you have to work for it, it's a Jinjo. Yeah. Oh, those carnivorous plants are able to live in this uh, polluted water just fine. Good for them. They, uh... They were born in the... the, the toxic water and therefore adapted to it? Ah. Eh. That, that's how adaptation works, right? Sure. We'll go with that. Now, while we're flying, I keep looking for hidden penises. 
<laughs> nice. He has figured out the trick. All the way to the top. I hear another Jinjo up here. Yeah, and you have to work for that, so probably that's going to actually be a Jinjo, not a Ninjo. Hang on. Oh! Aha! He remembers Rusty Bucket Bay, he does. I do! Uh-huh. And Mad Monster Mansion, I guess. Yes, that one too. Hey, where the f- Door 5, that makes a lot of sense, really. There's another window over there. I hear a bunny that we already helped? Uh, yeah, yeah. We have been here. Weird, okay. That's the service elevator. Mm hmm Yeah, see, I'm already confused. I don't remember where we've been. So I'm not gonna be any help at all here. Remember this for some reason. That panel oh, yeah. there, I remember that. You may want to give that another try, Argate. Yeah, give, give that another shot. Oh, I was off by just a, like, a pixel, wasn't I? Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, this is very OSHA. Mm-hmm. I'm glad we don't have to watch the, the little cutscene every time. Oh, come on. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Oh, come on. Alright, let's see what happens. Very ocean. Cool, cool, got a shock pad? Mm-hmm. Oh, hello. You know what, why not? Look, see, we're actually doing Grunty a favor. We're helping for OSHA compliance by opening the ventilation shafts. Mm. Yeah! And then next time she gets audited, maybe she'll actually pass. Right, That'd be here's scary. A... So if she has literal head. quarter long crushers, she's not passing shit. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, defective goods, it says there. What kind of defective goods is gonna, are coming out of an underwear factory? Yeah, ones with holes in them. Or extra legs. Hmm. Leg holes, I mean, you know. I know underwear don't have legs, but there's holes to put your legs in. Weirdly, I feel like that... You could still sell that to a, a certain crowd. Mm, not the ones with holes in them, though. But maybe. I don't know. Maybe you could market them like they market jeans with holes ripped in them already? They're pre-stressed underwear! Maybe Grunty was ahead of her time? Maybe. Oh wait, I could just go up there. Yeah, that's totally where you're meant to go. Back outside? Mm -hmm. Oh! What? See? Not very much at all. Just disc. You know, you can just jump back up, though. Yeah, just gotta make sure I don't electrocute myself on the way up. Oh, look at that, there's no railings around that hole. Anybody could just fall right in. One might even say that's the point. Hmm. And don't even get me started on Grunty's deficient policies of on lockout tagout. Oh. 
Cameron, I'm gonna need you to cooperate with me here. What did the boxes say? They go pants. Okay. Okay. And good for Grunty, I guess. She does it right for herself. You know, anyone running a factory of this size is clearly doing something right. Yeah. She's got a thriving business. She owns her own port for shipping. She's got a mansion and a castle. Yeah, no, she's... Dude, she is... She seems like she's, uh, got it all together. Yeah. I can't believe we're... I can't believe that we're saying that Grunty is a captain of industry. <laughs> she she kind of is, if you think about it. Do you reckon she ever vacations at Jolly Rogers Lagoon? I don't... I don't know. I don't feel like that's her scene, really. I mean, I could totally see her, like, sunbathing there and then yelling at, like, all of the other beachgoers to get off of her fucking beach or something. Yeah, she totally would do that. Yeah, no, she would. And she'd definitely go to Jolly's and order a ginger beer and see man's surprise. I think she'd skip the ginger beer and go straight to the surprise. But you gotta have ginger beer. This Jolly's special. Oh, there's another one of those screw panels, right? Yep. Just gonna yeah. drill a hole to that dude's skull first. Good call. At least that his skull is an easy target compared to this. Mm-hmm. Oh. The mumbo pad. Interesting. We haven't even seen mumbo yet. No, but based on the uh, service elevator, I'm guessing he's on the third floor. That would be a guess. Okay, there we go. Well, now at least we'll have his pad ready for him. And his house, too. There's no way down. Okay, cool. It's just wild and crazy here in... Grunty Industries. You know, maybe something smaller and a little more motile, you know? Well, it's clearly not Banjo. Mm, yeah, but... I have an idea. Oh, okay, we need to bring a battery over here. Mm hmm that you do. Somehow, some way. Uh, I think I remember split pad on this floor somewhere. I don't think this will do anything for me, but yeah, that was my thought when I when I saw that. Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay. Eh. It looked like a, a way in to me. It does look like a way in, but it's not. Let's not get stuck on the stairs there. Just gonna make sure that's not a ledge I can climb on. Cool. Kinda looks like it could be. It does. It is a pretty serious operation here. Hmm. 